Sawyer's kid. No. The driver is, how's his last name, Worst. His mom's a CO and his dad's a CO. Yeah. Up there on, uh... He lives on Stone. Oh, no. Sawyer lives up on... Sawyer's Bailey up on... Cedar Crest. He's on, uh... I forget which one of them. One that runs off by the sales. Stonely. Stonely. So fortunately, from what I understand, it's Joe's complaint, but I mean, I, I don't think he wanted anything done. But I let the parents know. But, yeah, I called Sawyer too. But, um, but get this. So right at 4 o'clock, Joe's got a statement come in. Follow up from a hit, or a unauthorized use, right? Mm -hmm. So he's in there for an hour taking a statement on it. Kid admits to it and everything like that. So Joe's writing his tickets. He's getting the appearance ticket for the unauthorized use. Sending me a text message on my phone. It said something along the lines of unauthorized use, class D felony. Do I arraign him or do I issue him an appearance ticket? What? There ain't no D felony. I, I fucking got right in the car. I drove right to the station. I go, what are you looking up? He goes right here. I go, okay, did he commit any kind of felony while he was in possession of this vehicle? Well, no. Then it's not uh, unauthorized use in the first degree. Flip back a page, unauth unauthorized use in the third, there's your A misdemeanor. Mm -hmm. Not to mention, even if it, w say it was a felony, didn't realize that you can't write a appearance ticket for a D felony. You have to arraign. Oh, yeah. yeah, I know. I like the guy, but I told you he's wrong. He, he is wrong. Sean, he's a cop for the money. I know. He told me that. I, I feel bad because I don't want to see anybody get hurt. I don't either. How do you think I'm going to feel if you and Dan leave? You and Dan go to dates. There's a reason. I'm, I know. Tired of the fucking I know. Shit here. And the worst part is, is I like Dave. His old man could give two fucks what happens to us out here. Yep. And that is true. Can we do up that dog and play? Um, I can do it. I only got one other one to do. I only got that one. I'll do, I'll do the dog. I got the time. And I got a fist. Okay, call me later. I'll be back. I'll see you out charge with a DWI and you need to be a good attorney. But you don't have to take the right, I'm back. Let me say I spoke with several attorneys. I don't know, where do you want to meet, bud? I'm at 546, where are you? I'm at Cleveland and Seneca. Can I meet at the high school? We can meet at the high school or I can meet you out in back of Glenwood, whatever you want to do. Don't you do the high school, I suppose that's it. Okay, I'll meet you there. Alright, bud. Yeah, McQueen's not eligible. Did he fucking actually go there? Selleck told me that that kid that used to work in Vernon was pushing for him to come over. And then he tried to, but he said he could have left. He can't. He's not fucking eligible. No. He's an idiot. Yeah, I hope he doesn't make it to his effing show. What a fucking retard. Tell you guys he was going to stay forever or something? No, he has to stay for a year. He thought he'd come in and just let him. So about a week into it, he goes to Whitestown, and the Whitestown Chiefs call and wants to get him out of it and wants to hire him. Really? Yeah. Because he's from there. So Don calls me. I go, Don, he can't go. He ain't got a year in. Well, we'll just hire him off our list. I said, if you do that, then I got to notify civil service that he lied about his address. He get hired here, and that will remove him from all civil service lists this year. He goes, you won't do that. I said, I kind of have to if you want to try to be like that. Why, uh, why <laughs> do you give him an address? Because he can't score high enough on the test. Yeah, but why should you fucking left him? I don't know. They wanted him helped out, so... Kind of like the kid from Vernon that was there. No. Uh, 
What's his name? Paul. Jason hey. Paul? He's another one. He can only score a 70 on the test. The only way to get him hired was to move him into the village. Yeah, he's on right? Yeah, there's Where the fuck's he coming from? Where the fuck's you guys going? Do you have another call over the radio? Where? Yeah, it's pretty close six. We're together. How do you know, Because I saw you guys when you pulled up. I was, <laughs> at the state, I was just leaving the station. Yeah, we weren't having the sandwich. Oh, yeah, Dave? Oh. I was fucking starving. Here he comes. This fucking transmission's gonna go. Six five five two 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 one six five five twenty two twenty one regarding damage. Regarding Jason, somebody. No, my house. <laughs> you didn't tell me. I always took your calls. I was where you're on it. Same with that dog. It took us twenty minutes to get there. <laughs> wow, was that long ago? I we, cleared up my oldest follow-up. What was it? Juvenile right. Another one got turned over to Tiller, and my only thing open now is that save on Call the kid and you get him to fucking just say no, you don't want to give a save. Hey, he wasn't home. I called and I went to the house. So I left my card and I told him, you know, call me when you get it. I'm going to go check it later. But he hasn't called yet. All well, we got to do is say no, I don't want to give a save. That's it. No, go we'll the nation place, nothing. Three hours and six, five, ten, or Sweet. You're fucking retarded. Did I tell you what I was going to do? What? When you give me a shot, five bucks and I'll proceed to change for his trouble. You should have. <laughs> You're going to fucking wait. Yeah, what the fuck are you calling us for for five bucks? It's three dollars. Not even five bucks. We're going to piss him off if we don't do nothing. I'm going to do the gaze off the front Told me. I hate it when the nation do their own investigation first. It makes everything more difficult. You know, would you like me to tell them that you should not do their own investigation? Start laughing. Well, it does. They're not police. They did everything except talk to the suspect. Okay, I told him. I go, the person that actually saw the license doesn't want nothing to do with it. I go, but I called the cop first. I go, and I could probably talk to her into giving a statement. I go, but. She really doesn't want anything to do with it, and she's out in Albany. I go, so unless you want me to drive out to Albany, she ain't coming here. What'd they say? Oh, we'll go do it. She goes, I don't care. No, no, I told that to the ADA. Keely. I've got her personal cell phone number. I called that first. It's not their line. That's why I had to ask Elbro what's the number of the fucking DA's office. I don't know. I like Liz. So do I. A lot of people don't like her. I don't. Subpoenas for everything. And she fucking, she's awesome. I don't care if she reduces everything. What the fuck don't, do I care? Reduce don't trump up charges and it won't get reduced. Go ahead. Reduce them all. What the fuck do I care? But take me to trial first. Yeah. And then plead it. I love that. <laughs> don't reduce it until you fucking bring me in for a trial. The chick the clown's pissed off at me. Has he said anything to you? No, I tell you what's going on. No. What was the, what did the note say? So I wrote up. They, you know that North Main Street, the old Dave's Market guy? Yeah. Well, one, it was a Sunday. There's like five cars at like 9.30 parked in front of the house. So I just got all the plates and the uh, registered owner information, and I turned it over to JP. Well, I wrote a memo because I was bored. Fucking off. And I was like, you know, yada, yada, yada. You investigators get to leave at 8 o'clock, and you're tucked into bed by 9 o'clock. There's actually drugs, go, people are doing drugs after 9 o'clock when you're in La La Land dreaming of Topeka or some shit. It was awesome. And I was bashing them. And then I go, but I'm a team player and 
I'm not gonna wait for that one traffic stop that makes me off through of the year, the biggest drug arrest ever, yada yada yada. <laughs> like your neighbor, I go, this is the other thing. And at the bottom of it, I go, this this memo is uh, unofficial, it should not be attached to any case or you know, files or nothing like that. So it was a joke. I let Myers read it, and he started laughing. And then I seal it in an envelope and I put future Sergeant Paul burn after reading. And I put it on his desk. They must open it. No, no, no. So JP opens it, he reads it, he starts laughing. Ah, oh, it was funny, it was a little sarcastic. Just saying, no, it's busting my balls. This was weeks ago. Well, apparently JP kept it in that envelope and left it on his desk. Well, Burgess must have went through his desk and he found it and he's pissed. So was JP going to say anything about him going through yeah. his fucking shit? I have to check the I told I told JP, because JP goes, I think he went through my desk. I go, JP, I go, I did it on the company computer, I go. But I swear to God, I didn't save it. I go, I'll check. I go, but even if I did, I would have deleted it. I go, because I delete my fucking internet history when I'm done looking at it. I go, I'm that paranoid. I go, I really don't think I saved it on a computer. He goes, oh, he goes, I know. He goes, I, I, I've been thinking he's been going through my desk, but now, he, you know, I, I know for a fact. He goes, well, I guess he wants to talk to me about it. He'll probably talk to you. And I said, all right, whatever. I go, but I, I kid you not, me, you, and Myers are the only ones that read it. I would say sealed it up after I, I showed Myers. Yeah, I didn't know to do that. Nobody saw it. You didn't see it, did you? No. Nobody I didn't even know about it until yeah. you tell me. And I'm like, what the fuck? Nobody saw it. He goes, I know. I saw it on my desk sealed up. I go, did you, I go well, where'd you leave it? He goes, I left it in the envelope. He goes, I think you were too much done. All right. Fuck. I guess he's all pissed off, though. And Burgess bitched to Meeker Jr. about it. Really? And Meeker Jr. told Paul about it. He goes, is that why Burgess called me and I missed his call? Yada, yada. I don't fucking care. I have no friends here. They go fuck themselves. I'm not a friend of yours. Well, yeah, I yeah. bust your balls. I was hoping Little was in his office. No, that would have been fucking horrible. I fucking I was, where were you yesterday? I thought you were going to come over for dinner. Fuck that stuff. I always went to Wendy's with Prowler. Prowler's was there. Yeah, it was 15 Street. Yeah, was Prowler's house. Well, Prowler's stressed out. Working. Who was supposed to be working for Supervisor? I'll go bump them? Good. Crowd from stressing, huh? So I'm waiting up. No, he leaves me alone. Yeah, who's Frank for that matter? Frank's left me alone probably the rest of the month. He likes me now since we took him home. Does he really? Yeah, his whole attitude's changed with me. I just stopped at cars, but I haven't got anything good. I was no. trying to get something around like the White Pines or Territory Road. But nothing so far. You know they're going to run. And if they run, it's a failure to comply. And that's an easy call. Or they're going to be suspended. There hasn't been nothing moving out there, though. No, I've been out there tonight. Go ahead. I have to lead it in Owen's mailbox, etc. If cetera. you want to swap ships so you can bump Meeker and you're covered by your JP, I can. What day is it? I saw it, but I wanted to wait and see. Anybody sign up for the school bus? Wait, no, 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 you're working. And me and Myers are off. Yeah. We still have to get You should get Myers to bump me, JP, and then I'll bump Mika. Dad really pissed him off. <laughs> Myers probably won't, though. You have more time than I do. 